okay so you have got a website in english language and you want to convert that website into other languages like hindi spanish or whatever language there is there out in the world so how you can do that if you have got a wordpress website then it's very easy to translate that pages into different different languages now converting your website into different languages can be done in two ways first is like using google translate service in google translation what happens is that your pages will be automatically converted into other languages but the problem with that service is that it is not very accurate so that's why a lot of people uh, do not prefer using that google service to translate the pages and what they do is like manually convert the english pages into different different languages so in this video i'm going to explain you how you can use that uh, wordpress plugin to convert your english language pages into other languages and a user can easily view the same page in different different languages okay so here i have got one website softfirst.org and this website is in english language by default but with the help of uh, the plugin i have added different languages so you can view the same page that is in english in different different languages like uh, i have added that marathi hindi language but you can definitely add other languages like german spanish etc uh, using that plugin so all you have to do is just uh, like select the language in which you want to view that page and then that page will be shown in that particular language so you can see that now i am clicking on this uh, marathi link and then this page will be shown in that language because i have already created or translated that page in that language so you can see that now that uh, page is converted into that language so after this i will uh, show you how you can uh, install the plugin and then configure that plugin to translate your pages in different different languages so this is the plugin multi language by best websoft so you can install that plugin directly from the dashboard so just log into your wordpress website and uh, i've already installed that plugin but if you haven't installed you have to go to the plugin section and then click on add new or there you can search that plugin by the name multi language and then it will appear in the search result since i have already installed that particular uh, plugin that install now button is not appearing over there but if you want to install that button should be there and then you can click on install now button to install that particular plugin and then activate that plugin immediately so after installation that particular multi language configuration section will appear over there you can uh, do certain settings here are the some settings that are default so i think you don't need to change anything out there in this uh, default uh, settings now next is important like you have to click on the language section and there you can add the different different languages this is very important so here you can see that i have already added this hindi and marathi languages in that particular section so by default only english language is there and if you want to add the new language all you have to do is just uh, click on the add new button at the top out there and then select a language that you want to add there are uh, lots of languages out there that you can select and after adding that language you have to also enable that particular language then only you will be able to convert the pages into that language and this is the uh, image or the icon for the language you can change that if you want the next thing that i'm going to uh, show you is that uh, how to convert the existing page english page into other language for that what you have to do is you have to uh, go to any page that you want to edit and then click on edit so i'm going to contact a speech and then i'll click on edit So this is the uh, page in the English, and you can see that there are other tabs for the other language like Hindi, Marathi. And uh, if you want to translate that page, click on the tab, and then uh, like write or translate that page in that particular language. So you have to do that uh, manually. You can take the help of Google Docs to uh, like uh, write in the regional languages, like uh, I have done here.
so google docs provide uh, the typing in different regional languages is, as you can see there uh, i can write in marathi hindi and you can also add uh, support for the other languages as well by going to the file menu and then selecting the language so you can see that uh, you can go to file and then there you can select different different languages in, in which you want to type so you have to select the that particular keyboard from that section that i just showed you earlier so if you have any questions related to this process you can uh, leave the comment and then i'll try to uh, reply to each and every comment So after your page is ready you can just copy and paste it into the title and the description section of that uh, in that dashboard and then update that page and once that is that process is done you can simply select the language on your website and then that page will be displayed in that particular language like right now it is in marathi if i want to we win uh, like english it will be i have to just select that english there so whatever language like i want to see i have to just select the language and uh, that menu doesn't appear automatically for that you have to go to the appearance and then uh, add that menu like uh, where you are uh, able to select that languages so this menu if you want to uh, show it on your website you have to save that menu in, uh, by going to the appearance in your wordpress dashboard so that's it about this uh, multiple language support in website if you have any questions on this do let me know through comments and i will try to answer each of them if you have like this video hit the like button and share this video with your friends and if you haven't subscribed to my channel do subscribe because i'm gonna get you a lot of technical videos like this one in the future that's it in this video see you in the next one till then goodbye and have a nice day